Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, I represent a group 7 uh, My group member have 3 people Namely Nurul Aida Binti Shabri My metric number is S58 C81 uh, Next Fatin Zuhaida Binti Kamis Metric number is S58 82 C And Nurul Sazana Binti Muhammad Zamri Metric number is S58 C86 uh, Our group title is online class during MCO We have interviewed three people Namely Nur Shafika Amalina, Siti Haja and Nurul Hanis In completing the course work assignment Assalamualaikum Miss, uh, sorry my name is Nurul Aida Bantisabri I am from University of Malaysia Terengganu Yes, what can I help you? If you do not mind, uh, I would like to you. Uh, sorry, I would like to interview you uh, about online class. Uh, that is uh, conducted uh, during MCO period. Okay, yes, you can ask. Uh, well, I will start uh, with the first question. Okay, yes. Uh, is online learning uh, effective to effective uh, for students? I think uh, for student understanding level and level of internet connect, uh, sorry, uh, connection for each uh, student. Uh, in terms of understanding, uh, okay, in my opinion, the presentation of information during online class uh, somehow is difficult uh, to understand, but for me, uh, uh, I prefer face-to-face -face learning because uh, some subject require face-to-face uh, -face teaching uh, to understand. So for as for the internet connection, uh, I think online communication is not very effective because uh, some student uh, might have problem in terms of in internet connection because uh, not all students live in uh, city, some live in the rural area, so maybe different students have different internet connection. Some students might have problems. Uh, that's all for my opinion. Uh, thank you uh, your, uh, for your opinion. Uh, Alright, uh, welcome. As for, as for the second question, is online education effective uh, for students in, in terms of uh, ability in managing learning? Is it managing? Uh, managing learning. Ah, okay, Alright, uh, so for uh, the effectiveness, uh, I think it, it is hard for me because I need to adapt uh, during the online class. I'm, I'm not used to online learning before this so I have to have support from my family they they help me so much especially my sister uh, I think uh, that is all the question uh, that I want to ask uh, for the, this interview okay, I want to ask you a few questions uh, about online classes during MCO uh, what is the question? In my first question is uh, Is the learning environment experienced by students at home conducive? Okay, uh, for students who are less able with definitely face their problems when performing homework, this problem include a noisy environment, cramped spaces, and not suitable tables and chairs. Oh, I agree with you. You, uh, second question. Yes, uh, is, is online education suitable for you? Okay, online education requires more discipline, traditional college courses because students do not meet directly at the scheduled time. There is uh, not need uh, for online students to schedule their own study time and courses. Okay. I, I also agree with uh, you. Okay, that's all for me. Thank you. Welcome. Yes. Uh, hello, my name is Fatin Zuhaida. I'm excited to have 
interview session with a well-known professor that will be sharing her thoughts today regarding online learning during MCO. Let us uh, welcome Dr. Aisha Binti Ahmad. Uh, Assalamualaikum Dr. Aisha. We are grateful to have you here with us, Dr. Aisha. How you feel today? First of all, I would like to thank you, Ms. Fanny. I'm invited to be here. I'm excited to be here and I'm looking forward to sharing some knowledge regarding online learning for MCO. We are pleased to hear that 2020 have been such a hectic uh, year due to COVID-19 pandemic and students are badly affected by this situation as they have to learn via online. Uh, could you please share your thoughts, uh, thoughts on how to handle with sudden uh, change of learning and how to perform in a very subject during ODS season? Session. I do agree with your opinion, Dr. Aisha. This step will uh, help students to adapt and perform during online learning. However, there is consequences uh, that should <laughs> that should uh, be discussed about ODL. Some argue that online learning will be resulted to internet abuse among students. Those internet abuse have a big impact on an individual, Dr. Aisha. I agree with your statement, Dr. Aisha. It is true that ODL have been on issue this day as they are a lot of consequences with the good and uh, go or bad will face by students. I hope the students will able to learn lot, lots of information from this talk and always be responsible with their action. With that, I would like to thank you, Dr. Aisha, for being with us today.